Welcome back to the Caribou Data Science Channel. Today is uh, Tuesday, December 29, 2020. I'm getting ready to run my, my report from uh, my, my daily COVID-19 analysis for the country of Spain. So let's just fire up the old program here and see exactly what's going on. Before we get started, I have a couple of minor requests. First of all, I want to give a big shout out to all 58 of my subscribers. I appreciate every single one of you guys and gals, but now comes the favorite part. I need you, I need all 56 of you, 58 of you, to step up to the plate, click the like button, and share this, and also click the share button, and share the link with your friends and family on all your social and media accounts. Share the link to this report on Facebook, on Instagram, on Twitter, whatever social media platform you're on, you're on share this report for Spain with your friends, okay? So take a look here. You can see that, you know, that uh, well, it looks like the mortality rate is actually creeping a little below average right now. But this is about 1.25, okay? You can see cases are continuing to increase and deaths continue to decrease, okay? So this is very good news for Spain. Because the declining case deaths is much more important even than declining cases, which doesn't make a lot of sense. But so here's the current weekly numbers right here: weekly cases and weekly deaths. No real change <coughs> change in monthly cases. Although it looks like there's a chance that <coughs> December's cases will not. Uh, Pass October's, uh, the November's cases. It also looks as if, well, you can see that uh, December's deaths have already passed all these numbers here. But that's a pretty good shot that the uh, <clears throat> December's deaths will not catch November's deaths. Matagold, 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 Matagold.